Does he really not know? Yes! Oh my gosh! This house behind me belongs to Noob1234, and we are going to be doing seven extreme pranks on his house. So do me a favor and hit that like button down below. Let's go for 100,000 likes, and we will do more prank videos. And just in case you guys are wondering if this is really his house, there is a chicken lake, which is a three block source of water. And then there is this abomination of a chicken. What is wrong with this chicken? It looks literally just like him. And I mean, just look at his chest. Need I say more? Now it is time for our first prank. And this is not like an ordinary prank, okay? This is a super dispenser. Now, if you've watched my previous Minecraft videos, you know what a super dispenser does. It's a dispenser that's super. Once the dispenser's activated, it will release everything that you put inside of it, which means you could put TNT, but most importantly, spawn eggs. And what I have in my inventory right now is five stacks of spider spawn eggs. We gotta find a really good place to put this down. I'm not sure where. If I want to fill his entire house with spiders and, like, totally freak him out, I think we need to put it in, like, oh, yeah, right here in the corner. This is perfect. Oh, and look, he's got, he's got his little chicken over here. I feel so bad. Oh, oh, no, <laughs> look at the face. Okay, I don't feel that bad anymore. So we are now going to right-click the dispenser. We're going to put every single spawn egg we have inside of here. And now here's what we got to do. So we're going to put a stone button on the super dispenser. Duh, we got to activate it. And then we are going to put a personalized sign, free diamonds. What noob does not like free diamonds? Actually, I'm not going to spell it like diamonds because I've seen noob1234 spelling and it is so bad. So I think he calls diamonds diamonds. I think it's like this. Click button. Oh, this is perfect. I feel a little bit bad about this one, but at the same time, I mean, he's a noob. He'll forgive me, right? Like, if I did this in your house, would you guys forgive me? Why don't you guys go ahead and sauce me a comment? Floopy, would you forgive me? Well, you know what? That's fine because Floopy is available on Amazon for only $10. So if you want to purchase Floopy, you guys can check out the link down below in the description. But we are going to keep placing down the cobwebs because what spider prank is complete without placing cobwebs everywhere? I mean, we have a lot of cobwebs here, ladies and gentlemen. This is literally perfect. Now what we have to do is we have to wait for Noob1234 to come home. And I'm pretty sure he was chowing down somewhere at a Chinese buffet, so he should be back soon. What a a coincidence a potion of invisibility now we can drink this and we can wait for him to come back inside i do not want to miss out on this prank because this one took me ages to set up i think this one's probably going to be one of the best pranks chicken you cannot give away chicken stop you're going to give away the pranks he's going to be back any second oh there he is what is he doing oh he notices the cobweb wait does he notice me oh i'm so glad that i did not leave the gate open that would have been a dead giveaway he's talking what is he talking to his children chickens do not talk come on he's reading the free diamond sign yes come on Yes! Let's go! Oh my gosh! Oh, this is scary. I am so glad I'm invisible right now. Otherwise, these spiders would be devouring me. Oh my gosh, wait, they are. No, no! Oh my gosh! Break backfired! Break backfired! Well, I gotta get out of here. Before I show you guys prank number two, I need you guys to do me a solid. If you are watching this video right now, which you are, but you are not subscribed, take your device and make that subscribe button as gray as possible. That way you never miss out on an amazing prank video like this one. So I call this one the Obsidian Trap. And what this one does is I have actually mine underneath this house. We've got pistons over here with redstone. We're going to place the obsidian on the sticky pistons. And then we are going to put stone pressure plates in the middle. Now, normally I think that you could probably get out of this. But knowing noob1234... He's not going to know what to do, and he's definitely not going to have a pickaxe on him. So we're going to place these stone pressure plates down like this. And just to give you guys an example of how annoying this is, watch. Once you walk over them, you, <laughs> you like, can't get out unless you're really fast. Oh, no. Am I stuck in my own prank? Oh, oh no. Wait, no. I know how to do this. I... Okay. Oh, there we go. Oh, see, it's super hard to get out of. No noob would normally know how to get out of this situation. Oh, there he is. There he is. Yes. Yes. Keep on coming. Come on. No, no. Don't notice. Yes. Yes. 
<laughs> Sorry, noob, but there's nobody who's going to help you today. Dude, oh my gosh, he's actually going crazy. You know what? This would not have happened to Noob1234 if he was wearing Preston Styles merchandise. Maybe next time, Noob1234, you will learn from your mistakes and go grab merch. It's so cheap, affordable, and comfy. There's no way you're gonna... He's trying to break it with his fist. We are going to be here for forever. <laughs> Okay, so for this one, I have to take off my headset because it is going to be extremely loud. As you can see, we have an entire hot bar full of TNT. You know what that means. TNT prank! You guys do remember the super dispensers we used in the first prank, right? Well, I may or may not have rigged a lot of them. Yeah, we've got a lot of super dispensers and we've got a lot of TNT and I've got this giant redstone circuit that's going to set them all off at once. This prank actually makes me feel a little bad for new one, two, three, four. I mean, not a lot, but a little bit. You guys do remember, he used to steal my wife and put her in prison. Wait, what does that lever do? What does that other lever do? All right, all the super dispensers are loaded. The headset is back on. I warn you to turn your volume down. This is going to be very, very loud. So here's what we have to do. I have built this perfect hole. Look, when I go inside of it, you can't even see me. I thought the invisibility potion was getting a little bit old. So now we must wait for our noob. This is literally like National Geographic. I'm just watching this noob. Oh, there he is. Hold on, he just went inside. We gotta break the block. Come on, here we go, here we go. Oh, he's gonna lose everything. I'm so sorry, noob, I'm so sorry. Oh, oh, this is bad. Oh my gosh. Dude, oh my gosh. I just realized something. We blew his chicken up. The last thing he says before dying is... Oh, I feel like a terrible person. But also at the same time, this is, this is what he gets for putting my wife in prison. I mean, come on, you can only feel so bad for the guy. But I think after this, he's probably going to need to move houses. So it didn't take me too long to find the noob's backup house because I found this sign, backup house. It was like maybe 50 blocks away from the house that we just blew up. It's actually, it looks like an abandoned mine shaft that he kind of built out. This is literally it. And there's no defenses, just a sign that is misspelled. And if you go inside of here, there's like nothing in here. There is a flower with a bed. Actually, I will say this. This house looks cleaner than his last one. Wait a second. What is, hold on. There's a book. There's a book. We got, we must read to attain more knowledge. Backup house. In case of emergency, I have made this special house. It is so well hidden. No one can find it. I can't help but feel that this is kind of what Brianna is like when she plays Minecraft. <laughs> Look, don't ever tell Brianna I said this, but she's also a noob. And I feel like they're kind of similar in some aspects, he even as a sign in here that says, do not blow up. So what I think I'm gonna do for this prank is I'm going to start removing every single torch from his underground house. Now, I do have full bright on so you guys can still see. So even though it might look bright, it's not. And mobs are going to start spawning soon. So I kind of need to break all these torches as fast as possible and pick them up not to leave any trail. There might have been one outside of his house. Oh, there's actually a couple right here. I need, I need every single torch. No torch must remain unbroken, ladies and gentlemen. And here we go, the final torch. The last thing we have to do, we have to shut the door. We cannot let him know that we were here. How long is this noob going to keep me waiting? I've been here waiting for ages. Okay, um, and I've got... I'm holding my bottle and he doesn't even realize it. Okay, I'm gonna tuck it away just in case. Oh, he's noticing he doesn't have any torches. Although he spelled his torches as Tor. Oh, this is bad. Oh no! Hold on, hold on, we need to follow him. We need to follow him. What's he doing? Oh, I hear some bombs! Yes, they're spawning! Yes! Why is he running? Why are you running this way? No, you need to run towards the exit, noob! No, no, oh my gosh, they are spawning so fast. Oh no, can they see me? Mobs, do not attack your master! No, 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 no! Hold on, how long is he going to last? Is he still alive? Hold on, I need to go find this noob. Noob, where art thou? Where did he go? Wait, did he actually die? He actually died? No way! I didn't even see him die. Okay, these mobs actually do a lot of damage. I am going to stay out of here. I have like an invisible arrow in my leg. This is just one of the many more pranks to come. Okay, I know what you're thinking right now. That prank wasn't the best. Well, let me tell you something. It was. And this one is even better. I like to call this one the infinite door prank. I think most of these pranks would honestly work even against my wife, Brianna. 
But basically what's gonna happen is Noob is going to have a lot of doors to go through. And I mean a lot of doors. But once he gets to the end, okay, I don't even remember placing this many doors, I promise you. At the very end, there's just a casual hole of lava. Now, what I need to do is I need to mine some blocks so I can spectate this. I think the best place to do it, let's see where, oh, I want, you know what? Before he falls in the lava, the last thing I want him to see is my face. Oh, this is perfect. This is perfect. He's gonna walk through, fall, and oh my gosh, I'm a savage. I think, you know, can I get some savage comments down below? Oh, and speaking of savage, check out this new Instagram photo. Do you guys not follow me on Instagram? Well, you should, at RealTDNRFrags. Oh no, oh no, 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 guys, we forgot to shut the doors. Oh no. Okay, I got so excited plugging my Instagram, I forgot. Oh no, he's typing in the chat door. We're not gonna have enough time to shut all the doors, so I'm just going to shut as many as I can without getting spotted. Come on. Come on, there we go. Replace the cobblestone. Oh my gosh, he's so close. He's actually so... Oh, I forgot a door. I forgot a door. We can fit... Oh, okay. That was way too close for comfort. Yes, keep opening. Yeah, he's so confused. He's like, why are there so many doors? I do not remember this. Yes, come on, just a few more. Oh, stay shifted. I do not want him to see me. Yes, one more. Yes. Oh my gosh. Okay, maybe after this pranking video, I will buy him a course to Preston's Pro Minecraft School. It's only $10 an hour. We've had a lot of fun in the noobs underground house, but we're not quite done yet. You know what we gotta do. We got to blow it up. So what I am going to do is I've kind of redecorated his house. You'll see this red stained glass. So I built a maze and I even gave him a hint with the red stained glass, but I'm assuming he's probably not going to notice the hint. But eventually if he follows it correctly and gets to the end of the maze, it's actually very long. I spent a lot of time on this more than I care to admit. But anyways, that's not the point of this, okay? If you follow it all the way through until the very end, you get to the beautiful treasure room. But the unfortunate thing about this treasure room is I am going to be filling it with TNT. And then I'm going to apply stone over it because of course we gotta cover our TNT. I can't just leave it uncovered. But once you place the stone over here like so, place down, oh no, I forgot which, um, one moment. Okay, now I kind of feel like the new beer. Look, rookie mistake. I will not let that happen again, okay? You saw nothing. You know what? Editors, cut that out of the video. Just a couple of more. Here we go. I got to be really careful, though, because I don't want to step on these pressure plates. So I'm going to go over here. Do we think the noob is going to fall for the same free diamonds thing twice? Of course he is. He's a noob. Come on. Free diamonds at the end of the maze. <laughs> Hashtag not clickbait. I really want to see if he actually takes this challenge. And of course, you know we've got to watch the noob. Like, I can't just do this and not watch him from above. So I built this special ladder to get us on top of the glass area. And now you have a much better view of the red stained glass. Like, it's actually a really easy maze to complete. But I am a little worried that I might have gone overboard for the noob. Uh, we'll see. There he is. Oh, he wants the free diamonds. Yes, don't you? Oh, there he goes. I wonder how long it's going to take him to look up. Oh my gosh, he's already gone in the complete wrong direction. No, 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 no. Okay, this is getting ridiculous. <laughs> no, no, why would you break the torches? That's supposed to illuminate your path. We all have friends that are this newbie in Minecraft. Would you do me a favor and comment and tag some of them? Oh no, dude, he's like a dog chasing his tail. Stop, stop, thank you. Oh my gosh, I thought we were gonna be here forever. You know what? I can't even have my headset on for this. It's driving me that insane. There he goes. Oh, he's actually making good progress. I am impressed with him. You know what? If he can manage to complete it in the next 10 seconds, I will actually take out the pressure plates. 10, 9, 8, 7, 5, Six, wait, three, <laughs> two, four. Uh, you, you get the point. I don't think he's gonna complete it before the 10 seconds is over. He's still struggling over here. What are you doing? Maybe I spoke too soon? Yes. No, no. Goodness gravy, Scott. Yes, go this way. Yes, yes. This is perfect. Come on. Yes, he sees the diamonds. We see it in the chat. Yes. Yes, I hear the pressure plates going off. Come on. Yes. Wait. Oh, no. Wait, did he actually die? Oh, my gosh. <laughs> Wait, he left behind a wooden axe. Just a wooden axe. This is all we have to remember him. He actually managed to mine one of the diamond ores. 
Oh, now that's just sad. This may be one of the saddest moments in Minecraft I've ever experienced. Once again, Noob had to move houses because we blew up his backup house, but I managed to find his backup backup house. No, this is literally not clickbait. It is a backup backup house. It's really, really, really small. This is actually even smaller than his underground house, I think. And it's such a backup house. He has a furnace placed backwards and there's nothing inside of his chest. But the biggest mistake that the noob made was he built his house right next to this grass hill. So what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to cover the entire house with grass blocks. And I bet you 1 million likes on this video, he is never going to find it. It's pretty much like hiding in plain sight, essentially. So all we have to do is place these down and cover it up. And he's, he's going to have no idea where his house is. He's probably going to think, like, did it grow legs and move? I mean, knowing a noob, I, I think that's probably what they would do. So after all of our hard work, this is what the covered house looks like. And I'm not going to lie, if I was on an SMP server playing with friends and somebody did this to my house, I don't even know if I would recognize it. This looks like any ordinary Minecraft hill in the plains. Are we in the plains? We, wait, yes, we are in the plains. I had to double check that. But seriously, I like, can you guys notice? I literally can't even tell the difference. This prank might be too far. I really hope he actually manages to find his house. Oh my gosh. This could be his last house that he has left. I'm going to be watching from this hill that's like right on the opposite side. I just want to see if he manages to notice anything. Oh my gosh. Wait, a little bit of a giveaway. The water is still there. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Perfect. You gotta love sponges in Minecraft, ladies and gentlemen. Now we could go hide. If this works, we might go down in history as one of the best Minecraft pranksters of all time. I already have the title Parkour King, but I don't know if I have the title Prank King, but I am willing to take the challenge. Here he is. Oh my gosh. He has no idea. He is currently jumping on his house. <laughs> does he really? No, 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 no. Is, does he really not know? Okay, if he really doesn't know, I'm kind of starting to feel bad. Oh no, he doesn't know. He's looking. No, 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 no. Floopy. Seriously? Floopy, do you think he actually knows where his house is? What do you know? You're slime. Oh my gosh. He says, where's my house? No. Dude. He's still looking for his- It's right beneath your feet! Okay, now I'm kind of getting angry because I want to type so bad. It's right below you, but I can't give away the prank. He's freaking out. Is he running away? Dude, noob! Your house is the other- No, the other way! Turn around! Oh my gosh! He is running towards the extreme plains biome. Does he not realize what biome he built his house in? What if he never finds his house again? That is actually a very real possibility. Another very real possibility. If you comment within the first 60 minutes of a YouTube video being uploaded, your comments will be displayed right here. Thank you for watching this video. Have a wonderful, fun, safe, blessed day. And I will see you all next time. Floopy out.